Today, the U.S. Postal Service hosted an official grand opening for the new Longs Post Office. The facility reopened last week, but today, News 13's Jackie Labrizzi reports on the official ceremony. The grand opening for the Longs Post Office happened just after 10 o'clock Wednesday morning. Many community members gathered for officials' remarks and the ribbon cutting ceremony. Yay! 7th District Congressman Russell Fry was there. He's been advocating for impacted residents who've been without a post office since a big fire damaged the building in 2021. Fry says the post office is listed in the U.S. Constitution because it's a core function of our government. When I was first elected, um, the, the earliest and probably most calls that our office has ever received to date about one subject was about the Long's post office. The post office returned to full service a little over a week ago and residents say it's much more convenient. Along with Fry, other officials, including the chief operating officer, members of the USPS, and the current postmaster have helped rebuild and reopen the post office. I also met a family who's had ties to this area since the late 1800s. I grew up right here in the crossroads at Long's. My grandfather, Willie Long, um, he used to own all four corners back when I was little. He was born in 1872. He had a store uh, on the side of the road right here, and the first post office at Long's was in his little store, and he, so he was the first postmaster, and I think that's how it got to be called Long's. Today's postmaster says they currently serve just over 10,000 customers and expects a 400% increase because of population growth. Reporting in Longs, Jackie Labrizzi, News 13.